Hello everybody, in this video I want to make a full overview of dropshipping from Home Depot to eBay. In this video I will explain you everything and give you all of the tips and tricks which you need to know when you start working with Home Depot to eBay dropshipping because these things will save you a lot of time and a lot of money and will help you to be very 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 and really profitable. So First of all, what is Home Depot as a dropshipping supplier, as a store, as a site, and why so many dropshippers so like this supplier and working with this supplier? So Home Depot is an American supplier which supplies ho home constructions and tools products. Home Depot has very different advantages over other suppliers and we will show in this video all of these advantages and how you can use them for your eBay dropshipping business. So let's go. The first thing is the free delivery over all over 1 million products. So if I go here, I can see that Home Depot, same as Amazon, offers two days delivery for free for many different products. And we will see now which products they really offer this shipping for them and for which not. So first of all, Home Depot always offer for products which are over $45 free shipping. So we can see here free delivery for over uh, $45 shipping. Now, you, you need to know that you can't split orders. You can't send two different products to two different addresses and calculate them together to $45. In the past it was uh, possible, now it's impossible. If you're using AutoTS to enable this feature to calculate the shipping price for you, all what you need to do is go to monitors and then Home Depot settings and here you can uh, click the include shipping time and that's all. This way Autodesk will calculate the price of shipping for you for products which are uh, less than $45. The next thing is that uh, let's take a look over the policies on eBay which you need to create when you work with Home Depot. So first of all about the returns. Returns in Home Depot are uh, less comfortable than in Amazon because here you need to put that the buyer pays the shipping because Home Depot will not, uh, or Home Depot will charge you for shipping uh, of the return if the problem uh, is yours. I mean, if it's not a mistake of Home Depot, you will pay the return. If the item came broken for, for you, so it's something different, and then in this case, Home Depot will pay the shipping. So we need to put here 30 days returns uh, and buyer pays the shipping. This way we will be covered because if uh, the product was damaged, we will still refund the uh, buyer, we will still pay the, the return and then Home Depot will pay the return for us. Be aware, you need to know that uh, Home Depot's customer support is really good so we can contact them and it's uh, uh, really great, same as Amazon. Not same as Amazon, but it's also really fine. About the shipping, so what I recommend you to put here is the standard shipping of the uh, United States and here it depends on you, two or three days will be enough. Also, don't forget to use HipShipper because using Home Depot you can also send to HipShipper and work with international uh, shippings. The next thing here is that for Home Depot you can also use the AutoDS helper to uh, take a your address from AutoDS to Home Depot and copy it with one click so it will make the, the order process much easier for you and you can also use our Chrome extension to grab full pages of products from Home Depot for example if I go to this page I can just click here click extract and then I can take all of the products from this page which is something which is really amazing for us another thing which I didn't uh, tell about Home Depot Home Depot has a lot of special products, unique products because they have their own brands and they have partnerships with some other brands. The good thing here is that Home Depot give you guarantee that they will be the cheapest. If you find another supplier with cheaper price for any of their products, they will just compare the price for you. Another great and amazing thing is that they have the price match policy. It means that if within, I think, 30 or 60 days, don't remember right now, but if for, for one of them, the product price will go down. For example, if you bought the product for $100 and then the product within 30 days went to $40, you will get $60 back. All what you need to do is to send them an email or create a chat and then you will get the money back. How to do it in AutoDS? It's very easy. 
If you go to your orders page in AutoDS, you can create an uh, export of all of your orders with the current price and the price which you uh, buy for, uh, for this price, the product. It means that in this report, you will see all of the prices differences and then you can just contact Home Depot and get your money back. Now, the next thing here is the break-even calculation. So how do you do it for Home Depot? You need to take in conclusion, same as Amazon exactly, eBay's fees, PayPal fees and Home Depot taxes. I recommend you to take for taxes around 5% for your break-even because this is the average plus minus. So what you need to do is if your eBay fees is 9.15 plus PayPal is around 4, you need to check, uh, it depends on your country, so it's 13.15 and let's do it, 9.15, you can check here in the top of the page, plus uh, 4 plus around 5% for the taxes, so it will be 9.15 plus 4 plus 5. This is your uh, break even plus minus, so uh, you, you can use this break even. If you have tax exam from home, for Home Depot, which is also many people selling this uh, service or you need the American uh, uh, company, it depends on you, so uh, you can also save this 5%. Also, there are some gift cards for this uh, supplier, which I also know that people uh, sometimes get. And one last important thing about this supplier is that you need to be aware that the prices here are not the same as in Amazon. In Amazon, if you see a price, it will be the same price for all of the destinations, for all of the addresses. In Home Depot, uh, for different zip codes, for different addresses, the price can be different. So maybe you will see a price a bit different between your monitoring tool and Home Depot. And this is the reason because monitoring tool scans only for specific zip code, but Home Depot uh, changing the price depending on uh, where the customer is from. I hope that you like this video. I think that in overall, this is a really great supplier and people are really making a lot of money using this supplier. I, I even saw a seller who made $30,000 in profits per month using this supplier. Under this video, I will add link to another video which explains how to work with the price match policy. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and leave a comment with what do you think about this supplier and if you already tried this supplier or do you plan to try this supplier. See you on the next videos. Bye bye.